Hiya, hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lavish V here, and a big thank you to each and every one of my subscribers. You are awesome, awesome, awesome. For those of you who are new to my channel, what I do here, it is some hair, fashion, makeup, beauty, vlogging, and a lot of perfume reviews. Yes, if you haven't already subscribed, Come on, you know what to do. Please hit the subscription button along with the notification bell. Please watch my videos and do leave me some thumbs up. And guys, girls, women, men, please don't forget to comment in my comment section as I am so enjoying the interaction with all of you guys. So yes, please do keep your comments coming. So guys, without further ado, let's jump right into today's perfume review and the fragrance i've got for you today it is by sean mendes and it is the signature and i think this one it is said to be unisex however this is the first sean mendes um fragrance that i'm ever trying so i didn't order a large one this is a 30 mils but it looks super tiny the box looks super tiny and um like it, it's got a, a guitar on the on the front of it and to be honest with you i'm not even sure who sean um, mendez is um but i'm a fragrance lover y'all so if there's a fragrance that i can lay my hands on to sniff to know to come and tell you about then i'm gonna do so because it's just what i love doing and I'm sure you are enjoying me coming here and talking about these fragrances. So thank you so much. And I honestly do appreciate you all. But let us talk about the look of the bottle. So the look of the of the box, it sort of remind me of um like uh on the sea for some reason it's like the deep blue sea like down down deep it's not the top of the sea it remember like um when you are out in the ocean and there's no land in land inside so that's what but i don't know what the guitar signifies because it don't like it doesn't look like it blends with the with the look of the bug so i don't know but maybe the guitar is like a signature and to be fair i don't even know who sean mendez is until i saw the photo of him on the back but i keep seeing the fragrances on different different websites so it must be a popular person but to be honest i don't know who he is even seeing the photo i don't know him still but anyway maybe i'm too old to know him or something so it says on the box that this is the sean mendez signature um fragrance and it's for women and men um perfume it um her um 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 uh, french um. and it's a other perfume spray so let's get rid of the box anyway because um let's not make it a long thing so okay so the the bottle it's um very blah huh it's it's I don't know I don't like the bottle that much but it's all right but it's not me I think because um, of the contrast with the colors it's not like a wow factor for me so it's kind of like a rose gold um, on the cap and and this one I don't know what I expect but I think it would have looked nicer in a silver with the blue than the color that they went for but hey you can do some contrasting if you wanna and the the the, the without smelling the fragrance it looks a bit oceanic that is the word that i wanted to say so without smelling it i've already kind of put my interpretation of the look from the box to the bottle and what i think the fragrance smells like so i did try it before 
this review y'all but i've only used it once just to see what it smells like and stuff like that and to see how long it lasted and all of that but before we get into that let's put the notes on the screen right here for you guys and then i'm gonna go ahead and spray my test strip and we are going to discuss we are gonna discuss this um sean mendes okay so what it is striking it is very sweet it has a very sweetness to the scent already and i think i should spray the atmosphere it kind of smell a little bit like a sweetie mm, it's it's for a unisex fragrance um it smells very very feminine on the opening like seriously so it smells like um a red berry pineapple tropical and sweet and and the look of the bottle the look of the bottle it deceives what you're gonna think it smells of and i'm thinking when i used it the first time when it came it's not the same smell that i remember it smells very different it's like frangipani but it's very different to what i remember but i think maybe because i did spray quite a few fragrances because i did have quite a few fragrances coming on that day the same time and i think all the sprays so even though i sprayed it on a different place i think the atmosphere or maybe i'd sniffed a fragrance and it touched my nose and the mixture with this one and that one came up something different but it really smells different to what i smelled before so or maybe it does smell different on the skin but But to be honest, I think it leans more feminine than masculine. And it smells like um caramelly. It smells nice. I like it. It's got some must to it. And it kind of reminds me of Ariana Grande fragrance for some reason. I don't know which one of them but it does bring me in the mind of ariana grande's perfume i don't know if if they bear any resemblance but that's what i'm getting and then you are getting your rose and it definitely sways more feminine than i'm pleasantly surprised this come like a a, um first impression for me but i've smelt it before but it, for, it just honestly just smell like a, a new fragrance i'm gonna have to spray this one on my skin y'all because i want to see if it brings me back to the first moment when i first smelt this or or i just mixed it with something and didn't realize so i have to spray it on my arm okay so it still smells very feminine um on my skin and i think what happened perhaps on that day i sprayed my arm with another fragrance and then i thought it was the other arm and then spread this one on top of it and it didn't come up like that and it doesn't smell oceanic at all it smells um sweet tropical um fruity creamy a little bit lactonic -y. that is what you get with this one it, it's i think 
the tropical vibe and the sea vibe maybe you're on the beach relaxing and sunbathing or reading a book and something like that so i think you are still on the beach so but it's not on the sea itself but the look of the bottle would give you that very oceanic feel but by no means it's not oceanic at all and with the with the right smell that i've smelled i didn't expect this review to go this way i like it and from my first impression of it when i opened the box i was expecting to say something totally different from the smell that i'm smelling to be very sincere with you i didn't expect this this is a new smell tonight from the one that i initially spread because i was thinking when i first spread it that day i was like i don't like it the mixture of whatever i'd spread before and and put this one on top of it i didn't like it so i was gonna say that oh i don't like it but i like it it's a new fragrance okay so enough of it i'm just gonna be honest and say i do like it it smells more feminine in my opinion than a male a masculine scent and if this um if a guy's wearing this i would think oh he's wearing his girlfriend's perfume and not that it came from his own collection so that's what i would i would think anyway um I don't want to keep you all too long but please if you haven't subscribed please hit the subscription button and also guys please check out my playlist I have a ton load of perfume videos for you guys any fragrance that you are into please check out my playlist I have so many so yes look after yourself and it's as per usual it's always a pleasure um, and do put some comments in my comment section take very good care until next time lavish re bye oh.